NASCAR Media Day, Daytona International Speedway. Mike Mullen from MikeMullen.net. Yep, Thursday, Daytona. And what have we got? The goodie bag. Wouldn't be a media day without goodies for the media. Hate to tell you this, I'm not allowed to take it. An honest journalist isn't supposed to take freebies like this. We got a bag out here just to show you what they're handing out in there, aside from an endless assortment of drivers. Drivers from 8 a.m. to 4.30. Talk, 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 talk. A lot of talking. Robbie Gordon had a few good things to say. And so did Trevor Bain. What a mystery that is. Tell me, when was the last time a Daytona 500 winner didn't make the race for the next, make the next 500? I think that could be a factor in somebody's thinking when we make the rules up for next year. Right now, Trevor Bain isn't locked into the 500, even though he won it last year. Danica Patrick never run a race in NASCAR Sprint Cup division. She's locked in. Huh? Well, let's go to the goodie bag right here. Okay, we got a really good goodie bag here. Okay, we got your rain poncho, and it's supposed to rain a little bit. Might need a rain poncho. American ethanol, green. NASCAR's going green. Rich crackers. I'm not sure whose sponsor this is. Oreos. I think this is Dale Jr.'s. Frosted Flakes, they've been around for a while. Who are they sponsoring this year? I can't remember. Is it Jeff Burton? No, that's Wheaties. I'm not sure what this is. It's a privacy protector. I need to protect my privacy. And this, this is a worldwide panorama. I think it's a poster. Don't know what it's a poster of? We'll have to open up and find out. And of course, we got hats. You want hats? We got hats. Here's one hat. Here's another hat. Here's another hat, and here's another hat, Edelbrock. I remember them. I think they make cams, don't they? Okay, in your official 24 Jeff Gordon mini car. Cheez-Its, was that Mark Martin's deal? Or is that Carl Edwards' deal? I can't remember. Camping World, trucks. Hey, remember that truck race here last year? Yes. I think the spoiler on the winning car, the winning truck, by Michael Waltrip, wasn't all there. NASCAR let it go. Gotta love this sport sometime. Here's a bag of fasten all. I guess I can fasten something. Here's a coupon for helping hungry homes. My home's hungry. Here's a cup, Dollar General. A lot of freebies here, isn't it? Here's a, uh, oh, this is a cup. Turvis. I have no idea what Turvis is. Here's some Scotch Bright. Disinfect my microphone. Here's a pad to write on. Here's a Grand Am Rolex for your beer. There's a lot of stuff here. I like this one. This is a Frisbee. I'm not too good at that. An elastic bandage. After this, they'll be coming after me and I might have to use one of these. Here's a book. John Roberts. The Great Book of NASCAR Lists. A list of lists? When was the last time a Daytona 500 winner didn't make the field for the next Daytona 500? I wonder if that's in there. Here's a something. I don't know what this is. Here's some sticky notes from my computer. Ah, I like this. Five hour energy. Yes, sir. Without Red Bull on the tour, could have to be hanging around five hour energy guys. I think that's Clint Boyer, isn't it? And of course, Robbie Gordon. Not Red Bull, not Monster. Speed, that's right. And here's some finishing stuff for this car that I'm driving. And here's a USB card. And here's a bunch of candy. That's it. Me? Hey, I'm looking to find out when the last time the Daytona 500 winner didn't make the field for the next Daytona 500. They got a page of rules and how you make the Daytona 500. Me? Why can't you just... Go on speed. If you're fast, you make it. And if you're not, you're not. Better yet, MikeMuller.net says, 
qualifying heats, like they do here Thursday. If you run well in the heat, in a race, the fans get to see something, and you make the field. If you don't run good, hey, come back next week. It's a long year. <laughs> like Kyle Busch was saying, we're going to Thanksgiving. Media Day. MikeMullen.net, and I'm tired.